trick of the drug war is not merely that it's been brutalizing to people who have substance abuse problems or are poor citizens or the people who are from this other America that wasn't incorporated into our post-industrial model. That's all true. But the other flip side of it is we can't even police our own cities anymore. It's ruined our deterrent. And it's made it so that the phone won't ring and that they don't look to the police department for help because they, they know no help is coming. We're asking them to basically police a prohibition that makes the entire community the enemy. When you lock everybody up, or you've locked everybody's brother or father or son up, and you're making, in a city of uh, 600,000, which is the population of Baltimore, 620,000, you're making 100,000 arrests a year. You've lost your mind. And you're basically treating people as if you, you are an occupying army. And there's no discernment between a drug arrest of a nonviolent offender, and, and the, and which, which you're making by the tens of thousands and getting paid for, and the arrest of somebody who's killed three people who you can't even find out their name. And that's the, that's the police department that, that we've inherited from the drug war.